everyone and welcome to the video edition of College Deco. Today I'll be giving you all the details about the Master of Science course. I will be talking about the course overview, highlights, eligibility criteria, admission process, top colleges, syllabus, jobs and scope. Let's start with the course overview. Master of Science is a two years postgraduate program that offers advanced knowledge in a number of specialized science fields such as physics, chemistry, biology, botany, mathematics, geology, nursing, pharmacy, etc. Master of Science is abbreviated as MSc. MSc is a very famous course and is offered in almost all the prestigious colleges and universities in India. MSc course is opted by the students who want to make their career in science stream. MSc course is offered in many domains such as engineering, information technology, nursing, management and many more. Now let's check the Master of Science course highlights. Name of the course Master of Science MSc. Duration 2 years. Minimum eligibility. The candidate must have pursued a bachelor's degree in relevant specialization with 50 to 60 percent minimum aggregate. Entrance exams BHU, PET, JNU, EE, BITSAT, TISNET, DUAT. Admission process Usually, most universities in India conduct their own entrance exam for admission in MSc course. But this year, CUET is the common platform for giving all the entrance exams. Apart from central and state universities, deemed or private universities also conduct entrance exams. Course fee rupees 30,000 to 50,000 per annum, depend on institute and specialization. Average starting salary 3 lakhs to 4 lakhs per annum. Career options agriculture industry, chemical industry, pharmaceutical companies, hospital, research and industrial laboratories. Testing laboratories, geological survey departments, colleges, universities, and all industry. Moving ahead to know the MSc eligibility criteria, the candidates must have passed graduation in science or equivalent from a recognized board. The candidate must have acquired a minimum aggregate of 60% in the qualifying examination. The candidates who are in their final year of degree can also apply for admission. Candidates will have to choose the MSc specialization based on his or her subject in BSc. Let's know the MSc admission process. The MSc course admission is done in two ways. In merit based admission, the admission is done directly on the basis of score obtained by the candidate in the qualifying examination. Some colleges also prepare a cutoff list based on the qualifying examination for admission. Entrance based examination is done on the basis of score obtained by the candidate at the national level, state level or college level entrance exams. The admission is done through the counselling process. Further, the MSc top colleges in India. MSc courses are extremely popular in India as there is a basket of science courses that gets covered as a part of Master of Science. If the students have the knowledge about the best colleges, it will be very easy for them to prepare for entrance examination and apply to different MSc college of their choice. The colleges are Jawaharlal Nehru University, Banaras Hindu University, Jadavpur University, University of Hyderabad, St. Thomas College, Chandigarh University, Mumbai University, Jain University, Sabitri Bai Phule Pune University, Kalinga University, Wilson College, Gaya College, St. Miras College for Girls, Amrita Vishwa Vidya Peetham. Now let's check the MSc syllabus. MSc syllabus will vary on the basis of a specialization opted by the students. As there are many specializations under Master of Science, the MSc syllabus for the same will be dependent on the selection of MSc subjects under a particular specialization. The syllabus of MSc normally includes core, MSc subject list and elective subjects related to the course opted. The core MSc subject list are compulsory subjects and add value to the specialization while elective MSc subject list include the important aspect of any specialization. All the compulsory core MSc subjects have both theoretical and practical aspects. Now the most important topic to cover MSc job prospects. 
MSc degree opens many job opportunities for candidates in the both private and public sector. Students who have a keen interest in research work can opt for doctorate and research programs for jobs in colleges and universities. The suitable employment area for MSc graduates are agriculture industry, chemical industry, pharmaceutical companies, hospital, research and industrial laboratories, testing laboratories, geological survey departments, colleges and universities, oil industry, researcher, clinical research specialist, professor and teacher, lab researcher, science advisor, taxonomist, pharmacist and plant biochemist. Now lastly, let us know about the MSc scope. There are multiple scope after pursuing Master of Science in both private and government sectors in various departments such as medical laboratories, biotechnology firm and academician, researchers, food institutes, scientists etc. With the advancement of science and technology and its application in various fields, the candidates after pursuing Master of Science apply for many top companies of the world for different position in the area of research and innovation. Some of the popular organizations offering jobs to the students of Master of Science are ICAR, CSIR, ICMR, DRDO, BAC, BARK, RC, ISRO, TIFR, TIF, NIF, NEF, etc. Students should also know about the MSc Advanced Courses. There are three types of advanced courses that a candidate can pursue double masters master of philosophy doctor of philosophy that is phd and apart from that they can choose any other also field to join i think i have given all the necessary information about the msc course to get more details about the course stay connected to college deco thank you and bye bye if you like this video do like share comment and subscribe to our YouTube channel.